Hey everybody, hope you're all having a good day today, at least better than I am. Uh, this was supposed to come out yesterday. I had to record a video uh, announcing that I was going to be hosting the open mic at Recovery Room, the Thirsty Thursday open mic, uh, from 7 to 10 this Thursday. And I confirmed that yesterday during the day and then came back and got it recorded. And then the video didn't upload correctly and so... Been a big mess. But uh, ironically enough... Today I tested positive for COVID-19, so I'm having to re-record this intro video to tell you that I'm not going to be hosting this week at Thursday, Thursday at Recovery Room. Uh, so, yeah, that sucks. And I don't feel good. It's okay, though. We'll get there somewhere. Uh, you should definitely go check it out, though. It's an open mic for music and for spoken word. If you perform anything at all, go in there, sign up. It starts at 7. Uh, my friend Courtney will probably be there. She usually goes and sings. Uh, and she's pretty good at it, too. So go check that out. Uh, uh, as far as this video today, you are about to watch my performance from Local Fest on September 8th at the Recovery Room. It's uh, If you remember, I told you that I was supposed to host the open mic after the show. That, unfortunately, did not happen. Uh, that we had to make a switch, a few different switches actually, and so there was no open mic. But on the bright side, uh, they gave me a, a 10 minute spot and I, I did go a little over time. Uh, in fact, I got the light and I was like, I've got at least two more minutes. So, you know, it, it happens. Things happen. Life happens. That's the way it goes. But uh, yeah, it's it's nothing new. You've seen it before. It's It's about me and... Uh, uh, NASCAR and Crappy Night together. Uh, so, yeah, I hope you enjoy it. Let me know what you think down in the comment section below. Uh, make sure to like, subscribe if you haven't, you know, all those good things. And uh, enjoy the show! I want you guys to give a huge round of applause for Bryce Moore. Y'all give it up for Bryce Moore. Yeah. What's up? How yeah. you doing? We're having a good time so far? Yeah. yeah. Good, 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 good. I'm just as surprised as y'all are. Uh, <laughs> oh, man. If I can figure out how this mic stand works, we'll get started. Okay. All right, so uh, I'll tell you a little bit about myself, y'all. Uh, real quick question, quick question. Are we listening? Are we the ladies? That's what I thought. <laughs> Thank you. Do I have everyone's attention now? Yeah. Thank you. They heard local and they said, no, I don't care. <laughs> My brother liked that. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> quick question, y'all. Did anybody here have great grades in school growing up? Anybody? Yeah. You did? Do you have a good, good, good? I did too. All the way through school. All the way through high school. In fact, by the time I turned 18 and I was in my senior year, everybody was super excited about what I was going to do with my future. They were like, Bryce, Bryce, where are you going to go to college? And I said, Arkansas State. And they said, that's good, young man, that's good. And what are you going to study? And I said, theater. What? <laughs> I said, yeah, I'm going to be an actor and a comedian. They, they said, oh, he's going to have a job with his name on his shirt. <laughs> and now I'm a janitor. <laughs> but I work on a college campus, right? So whenever people ask me what I do for a living, I just tell them, I work in higher education. <laughs> That's right. I was at work one day and I was by myself, right? And uh, I was thinking through some material, trying to get ready for a show, and uh, you're just thinking through, saying it to myself. Only problem was, I was getting really into it, right? Like, I mean, I've got my hand working, I've got my arm gesture, y'all, the, the imaginary audience was loving it. They were <laughs> loving it, eating me up. And so then I looked up and I noticed there was somebody standing there that had been watching me the entire time. <laughs> so. I just turned to my right and I said, it would seem this conversation is no longer in private. Perhaps we should reconvene at a later date. They didn't walk away. <laughs> so I turned to my left and I said, why, well, yes, you are correct. We shall speak another time. And I looked them right in the eye and I said, hi, how are you? Lovely day we're having, isn't it? And you know what?
tell you all, HR is actually really friendly once you get to know them. <laughs> <laughs> Could you tell? Yeah. I have a lot of time to myself. No, there's nobody in my apartment, y'all. I don't ever have company. I had roaches for a while. But I got rid of them in like January or February, and I'm starting to miss them, you know? <laughs> so needless to say, I get bored and restless easily, right? So when I'm feeling that way, what I like to do is just hop in my truck and drive around town and blast some music. But I don't know if y'all have noticed, gas is expensive. <laughs> and I'm just a janitor, so I'm poor. <laughs> but what I can do, I've got a NASCAR video game. So I can turn on that game and then Bluetooth my phone to my soundbar. So it's like I'm going for a drive without leaving my recliner. And I know what you're thinking, but Bryce, it's just... A it's NASCAR, you're just going in a circle. No, 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 no. It's got road races on it, y'all. Yeah. It's got right turns on it, too, just like the real thing. <laughs> and just like the real thing, I always somehow end up in the traffic jam. <laughs> 37 car pilot, my walking spin. Sorry, y'all. That's my bad. <laughs> I spun out. You know. <laughs> I actually started trying to race online against other people instead of just the computer, you know, just to see how I could do it. And, uh, I came in 41st place. <laughs> I'm not too good, you know? Uh, the worst part is there, there were only 40 total cars. <laughs> yeah, I got beat by a pace car. <laughs> Figure that one out. And really, it was 39 other cars and one old man on an electric scooter. I hate modders, y'all. <laughs> That's cool, not everybody likes that one. <laughs> 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 I think I know where I messed up though, y'all. I messed up the most important part of a race car. The car's nickname. A good race car's got a cool nickname, right? It's got something that commands respect. Makes everybody kind of scared of it a little bit, you know? But for instance, Dale Earnhardt, he had the Intimidator. Jeff Gordon had the Rainbow Warrior. Y'all know what I call my car? The Tortoise. <laughs> well, they say that slow and steady wins the race. <laughs> All slow and steady got me was a participation ribbon. <laughs> Not even a trophy, just a pink little ribbon from the dollar store. It says birthday girl on it. They felt bad about that, so they took a little sticky note and wrote, Well, you were here. <laughs> Y'all think I'm kidding, don't you? Look at this. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. <laughs> Take it out of the oven, put it on a plate, cut it, go poop with it. I've seen him do it. It's been a while, but I've seen him do it. Anyway, the drinks come out, no word from Morgan. We order the food, go, the order goes back, food gets prepared, food gets delivered, no word from Morgan. We don't know where he is, we don't know what's going on. Right? And my mom looks up, she says, Bryce, you need to go check on him. Me? Why do I have to go check on him? She goes, well, he's your brother. Well, he's your son. 
that I don't want to have this argument in public, so I just go and check on him, you know. And I get in there, there's only one song, there's nobody else in there, so I just knock. I said, Morgan, it's Bryce, are you all right? And he's in there. No. What's wrong? I got diarrhea. Hold on, and I return to base to report to my superiors. And my mom's like, well then what'd you do? And I said, this! I came back! And Tammy's in there, Bryce, you're 18, you're an adult now, you seem to be assessing the situation, coming up with solutions. Hey, listen, I'm a rookie, don't be putting me in the end zone. Okay? You gotta suck me out about the 20 yard line and put in a two to three year veteran. Otherwise, if you put me in the end zone and leave me there, I'm gonna fumble. That's going to create a huge mess, and given the circumstances, I'd say that's really going to sink. <laughs> I'm glad y'all like that. <laughs> and she said, well, how bad is it? And I said, how bad is it? Sir, think about the last time you had diarrhea. <laughs> how bad was it? That's what I thought. Has anybody had a good diarrhea experience? Show of hands. <laughs> we'll talk later. Anyway, <laughs> this one was not good. She said, "You didn't ask him how bad it was." And I'm like, "Again, only this guy with the beard has had a good diarrhea experience." <laughs> she said, "Well, go ask him how bad it is." Fine. All right. Cool. I'm gonna go back to the bathroom. Still nobody else in there. I knock on the door. I said, "Morgan, it's Bryce again." I said, "How bad is it?" It's all on my underwear and all over my jeans. Like, like visible from the outside? Yes, very visible from the outside. So I returned to base to report what I had learned to my superiors. And uh, my mom was like, well, then what you do? And I said, we've been through this. And then Tammy's sitting there, assessing, assessing solutions. And I said, hey, rookie Enzo, rookie Enzo, it's about 23 year veteran. <laughs> we're trying to figure out what to do, y'all. Because we can't just leave them. You know the rule. No man gets left behind. You know? So then my mom is like, wait, Bryce, what about your jacket? I said, what jacket? Your kiss jacket. I don't know nothing about a kiss jacket, y'all. A jacket with my favorite band on it. Oh, no, 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 no. I ain't got a kiss jacket. I ain't got a jacket at all, y'all. I'm cold right now. I said, Whoa. <laughs> Where's your jacket? I said, it's in the car. She says, go get it. It's fine. I go and get my jacket, and I think I see where she's going with this, but she tells me the directions anyway. She says, tell him to tie the jacket around his waist and just throw his underwear away, and the jacket will cover the same. I'm like, right, cool. I text out the, inf the information on the phone. I slide it under the stall, and I said, read it. I said, does that make sense? He said, yes. So I toss the jacket over, he slides my phone back to me, and I go back. The mission is in his hands. I can't do anything now. It's taken a minute, y'all. My mom's like, did he understand his instructions? And I said, he told me he did. And along about that time, I noticed him walking from across the restaurant, real gently, just baby steps. He gets a little closer and I see he's got one arm stuck out. And I look and see what's in his hand. Y'all, I swear to you, as I'm standing here now, he is carrying his jeans. <laughs> the jacket, oh, I gotta tell you about the jacket. The jacket's the best part of the whole thing. It's not tied with the sleeves around his waist. No, 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 it's wrapped and zipped in the front like a kilt, kinda. And I know what you're thinking, Bryce, that's not very stable. He takes one little misstep and that thing's gonna fall. He's gonna be out in front of the, and I'll be up in front of God, everybody, and you're right. That would happen. Luckily though, he's a bigger guy like I am, so he can kind of press down the front of it with his stomach like this, you know, hold it here, and then for the back, and just kind of stick his butt up, let gravity work for him and not against him, you know? He looked like some kind of crazy Scottish golf, you know? <laughs> I just picture this, you know. Aye! Look at that for another bridge! It's a nice new pair of jeans! I reckon that skid mark will come out in the creek, don't you think? 
That's all I got for you, John Troy. You guys are so much fun. God bless you. My name is Bryce Moore. You can find me on YouTube, TikTok, Facebook, Instagram.